David in Rochester, United Kingdom writes to me, Paul, my new music collection comprises mainly DSD recordings, and so I am always interested to hear your take on DSD. I have heard you say that mixing in DSD is not possible, and so would appreciate hearing your view on the Mixing in Pure DSD article and video that came out recently. Okay, um, yeah, of course you know I am a big fan of DSD. Octave Records is all DSD based. Our entire studio uses the Pyramix DSD system. Our DACs convert everything to DSD and output that DSD stream directly into a fancy low-pass filter and that's what you hear. So yeah, to say we are advocates of DSD is to put it mildly. <laughs> We very much think DSD is far superior to both analog and to PCM. DSD is the ultimate end game when it comes to audio reproduction. And that's why we build all of our equipment around it. It's why we built our studio around DSD. Yeah, I would say we are advocates. Okay, but as many of you who have watched this series before know, Pure DSD, regardless of what, if it's DSD uh, 4, 2, 3, whatever DSD-ish speed is running at, it is a one-bit system, and you cannot do math on one bit. Just can't. And therefore, you can, in our editing, in our mixing, uh, we can we can take an editing, you can grab a snippet of DSD and move it over here, move it over there. Uh, you can do all sorts of things. What you cannot do is change the volume of a DSD signal. It is what it is. So when we record at Octave Records, everything is done DSD 256, and that's 4X, and it is what it is. When we mix, we convert it to a fancy form of PCM called DXD that if you start with DSD, you don't lose anything by going just a bit of math to get it over to DXD and then back again. You can't do the opposite. You can't record in DXD and then go to DSD. It doesn't work. Oh, yeah, it works, but it doesn't sound right. So you have to capture in DSD, and then you can screw around with it in the mix and all that in this other format, and then put it back, because now we're only doing a bit of math, and we're not losing any anything. And I've done, the, in, pa in Paul's post, I've done the math, and I've shown that they are actually the same thing. They really aren't any different. It's just a different way of expressing it. One is one bit running at 11, or no, it's, what is it running at? 5.6 megahertz? I think, and another is 32 bits <coughs> running at 352 kilobytes, uh, kilobits, but or, or kilohertz gets rough. Um, but if you multiply that out, 32 times 352, it turns out to be exactly the same frequency as the one bit. Anyway, we've gone through all of that. Same thing. That's why, we d that's why we record in DSD and we mix in DXD and then back again, and we don't have any loss. All right, so there is a movement out that says, well, you don't have to go to DXD. You can do it in pure DSD. And uh, our friend uh, who, Juicy Lasso, that makes the, the amazing uh, program uh, that m many people use, um, and and we use uh, to do a lot of the transcoding and all of that um, makes it possible to actually mix in DSD. Now, how does that fit in <coughs> with what I said that you can't do it on one bit? Well, you can't. So what they do is they change the one bit to multi-bit. So you've got four or five bits. <coughs> is it still technically DSD? 
Now, technically, now you've gone to PCM, but you know, a lot of this is semantics. A lot of this is it. You know, I would say DSD is one bit. As soon as you go to multi-bit DSD, you're really in PCM, and we could argue that out all day long. Uh, and I don't want to get into it because a, it involves a heck of a lot of math of which I am incapable of. I struggle with two plus two. So I'm not going to get in the middle of this whole thing, but I, I know enough about it to say that, that what, what's happening, it's the same thing that they do in modern DACs. Modern chip DACs use a sigma delta converter to take the analog signal and convert it to multi-bit DSD. And they use a, a, an SDM, which you need to make one bit DSD, but it can also make multi-bit. And multi-bit DSD, PCM, can be manipulated and mixed. So it's, it's gonna cause a lot of controversy, and I don't wanna get in the middle of all of it. <laughs> but I uh, hope that long, rambling explanation gave somebody some insight somewhere. Yeah, okay. Talk to you later. Thank you.